share about the ICU's experiences. So the volunteers like giving thanks to um, how amazing that sharing is, and really um, uh, supporting that the idea of being environmental friendly and. So here's um here is the like everybody who work together and then we everybody is a big telling. So today we are presenting a volunteer from overseas. She is from Ohio, on US. She was in the poetry um group. So um. She was invited by Sister Bang Wen, and she has she is really gifted in words and writing. So, um, <laughs> so she yeah she was in the um volunteering, and Sister Mayun was saying that oh yeah, I I don't remember like like how can I didn't invite Sister Shuijing into the um editorial team, but um we're glad that Sister Fang Wen has invited her into the the poetry team. So, so Sister Suijing has been growing up in a family who had long history of um uh, being scholar and has long been um uh, like she's very well educated in in writing and in um uh, a lot of uh, literature. So in the beginning, when she hear about Suji, she was she heard it from the radio station. So um, she she has been writing a lot for Suji, and then now we'll be able to watch her sharing. So now here is a clip. <laughs> this this news clip has two parts. One is a a um the part about Ohio. So this is Sister Yame. So this is like um a um sharing of the sign language performance by the teaching by the college student, and also. Um, so the one who's speaking right now is Sister Shui Jing. So she's talking about being vegetarian and it helps a person to um, feel at ease. And if we can be vegetarian, we will be able to um, let go a lot of personal conflicts and then to make a better um, human relationship. So this is another a Cixin volunteer to share about how oh that that was her daughter who so was was um was sharing that how she also benefited from being vegetarianism. So there's another one that's clear about her, but this is about a child parent classes. So yeah, so look at our volunteers who usually stay in the in 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 the back, and so when we try to find their video clip, um, in some some documentary, uh, it's actually difficult. But so this is a one of few clip that we could find about her. So. Mm. Anyway, so <laughs> we will welcome to Sister, welcome Sister Seijing to join us online. So, every, greeting everyone. Thanks. Thanks, uh, Sister Mei, for finding all those clips. It's oh, it's so very um precious to me. 
So, dear master, level masters, and everyone around the world, how are you doing? I'm Beijing from Ohio, America. My Dharma name is Yu Zhen. So thanks to Sister Ming's invitation, so I can share my experience as a poetry team for the online study group. It is amazing. This is um on today in America still November twenty nine, and this is Giving Tuesday. The entire U.S. team are trying to fundraise and to get more people to um donate and also in active their um kind kindness. So I'm so grateful to have to share with you all in this precious moment. So to my the theme of my sharing is to collecting the positive energy and spread the love and kindness. So it was amazing that I was able to contribute the little power that I little ability that I have. And to do working with people, I have learned so much, and I have made a lot of um uh to improve a lot. So one of my favorite first Bhagavad Sutra is one to infinity. So one seed can grow into infinite body trees. So if we can plant the seeds and love in people's heart and cultivate it with with kindness, we can not only um, have a good reward and also help our others to plant more seeds. I'm from Dalian, China. I've been living in Ohio for 25 years. I'm a software engineer. So I like reading and writing um, as a hobby. So I start joined Siji in 2014, um, and I quit my job in 2017 to focusing um, doing Siji work, reading master's book, and study um, master's book. And I have also made my own audio book, a Siji audio book and share with my friends. So this year, I have a opportunity to go back to the uh, to working play, uh, work, the work environment. So I have working, I have been hired by a larger com large company and have a put opportunity to engage to more people. So now I I make a vow that I would want to that more people to understand Tsuji and then to uh, walk into Tsuji world. So my major uh, pressing goal is to promote vegetarian and um, asking pe more people to adopt that lifestyle. As um, the Feng San volunteers sharing, I I I had also I've, like we have to collect a lot of small small people's well power and ability to together to um to make that work. So in two thousand in April two thousand eighteen, I have joined the poetry team. It was really really. Um, great experience. I have admired Sister Cixin, and thanks to her, um, to her for her to study this whole project, and thanks to Fang Wen for the special common common affinity to be accompanying me, and thanks grateful for a lot of more volunteers, brothers and sisters to join to shoulder the responsibility together and to um, to coordinate and learn from each other and also really, really grateful for Sister Mayings, um connect, connecting everyone together. And this is really proof that everyone is very talented um, to, for this. So online study group is a really, really good platform to nurture talent. So, Sister Mary has lead a team to continue to break ceilings, to break to 
to adjust and adapt to environment. But the only thing that never changes is the principle. And then she never doubt that the test master gave it to her, and then to、um, always always overcome the obstacles. And in a group together, that we learn from each other, and we、um, we avoid each other. So putting your heart will make you. Go a long, a very far, very long way, and then this is really good、um, example that showcases with good intention comes blessing, and with the will comes the strength. And this is really like one to infinity. It's like when you have one person study and then you have all the join. So. Being participating in this platform is a、um, growth for me. So, in the beginning,、uh, when I start writing these poetry, I need to spend a long time. I need to think about for a few days. But now, when I calm myself down and being focused, I can finish all the project within probably a night. And my my take for this is to proactively. Taking on the challenges and to put all your heart into it, you know, after accumulate for a while, you will be a expert. I believe in. She has been writing for like over fifty times, and she believe in like like the you will you will accumulate through like little or the little experiences. So he, she had wrote about eighty pages, about twenty three thousand words, Chinese characters, and this is a really, really good footprint that she has enjoyed in her life. Through every time writing these poetry, I have into, I have gained a lot of、uh, touching moments. And I understand that we have to、um, do it so for us to actually learn and grow from it. One of the major thing is、um, during the process, I have accumulated a lot of positive energy. And I have, as I mentioned, in 2017, I have,、uh, I have like quit my job. So, so I have been doing、um, a lot of work in the office and for some other、um, comedic affinities. I have turned to the online、um, online events. So I have been sharing a lot in the WeChat group. I haven't, I have not、um, stopped, and I have been continuing doing that, and have been getting a lot of good、um, the response and reflect. The one that is really, really touching me is that、uh, for this online group study study groups that they will always. Have really good materials to help you to to learn and then to improve and then to um to use as a material to talk about、um, stuff. So in in study group, I also learn a lot of ways and touching story about promoting vegetarianism, and I got a lot of materials I can use. And So yeah, we have volunteers that shared before that how they promote vegetarianism in their line group and WeChat group, and share your um recipes with other friends and to a share about the principles with your colleagues and friends. It was really really happy. Um, I have made a vow. I will always、um, promote vegetarianism in the place I work and with all my friends. 
So, well, the study group is like once a week, but I only um, need show the responsibility for one to two twice per month. So I didn't really feel I don't feel like I have given a lot. So I really cherish every opportunity that I had to um, to share to to work on the task. And every almost every time when I watch the sharing in the online group study, I I I, I find tears in my eyes, and really love the the volunteers, the sharing people's um such family, their life stories, and the the book studies and the the city world's the latest events, current events, and how. Uh, so to volunteer work and I uh, participate and then to to give love around the world and and then with all these doctors um compassionate actions and there's so many so many things that 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 the words to sharing and uh, there's so many touching stories we're really really grateful for all the um, opportunities. I feel, I feel I'm just a small firefly. I am very grateful that I have a opportunity to join the team to give the little uh, ability that I have. So I will continue to light the light and then to share the love and compassion to the world and try to light more lamps in people's hearts. Like once in infinity is like well, when we get a lot of people together, we could make great things. And we're, we're grateful for Sister Mary to open this flat platform for us to make great common opportunity affinity with other people and to make great connection with other people. And this is really precious moment for us. So in conclusion, I will use one to infinity and then to hope that every seed can grow into a great field of blessing. Thank you, thank you, everyone. I'm just grateful to be able to share um, here. Thank you. So in 2022, we have 500 people team. I'm hoping that we can, in once a month, we can um, share, we can introduce a team. And there's a lot of, um, yeah, because we, we used to be really busy every time, and then we, we don't really have a lot of opportunity to hear uh, each member's stories. So through this platform that we can actually hear, hear the you know, volunteers in the back and then to share about their story and then to, to show that how they walk at Dhamma. I'm really grateful and really uh, uh, appreciate that, you know. And when we, I, I, when I, when we have 500 people, I thought it was a really good number, and it was like a great, great, great team. And I realized that Master Chen Yang actually told me that, you know, we still need more people. So she really hoping that we could uh, all recruit more members and to help up so like we our team can grow larger and larger thank you thank you sister sui jing um if you get to know her more